Hello and welcome to my channel and welcome to a lovely mix of cards. I got some new ones, I got some newish ones, and boy have I got some oldies. Christmas cards in March, March the 28th to be exact. It's March the 28th from I'm scratching this. Don't know what day I'll put this out, but yeah, <laughs> it's weird to still see Torpays of Christmas in the shops. And um, yeah, I thought I'd put them all to the test. So some oldies against some newish ones against the brand new snack stack or at least brand new to me because i haven't really seen these and um do you know what i couldn't resist buying these because hd symbols how could i resist not buying these whoa let me out those hd symbols makes all the difference hd symbols my backside <laughs> anyway let's spin the camera let's get into these cards gonna start with the oldies and um went away from there to be honest with you and do you know what I'm going to use an old coin. There you go. An old scratcher. If I've got an old scratcher. There we go. I'll use this anyway. Here we go. So looking for pears. Just in case you've forgotten how this plays. On it, lovely. See mince pies and holly. Christmas and riddles. My favourite word to say. Bubble. And an ice cube. Have they just used that on um, that symbol on Coffee Break? And just called it sugar cube. They used the exact same symbol. I think they have the cheeky little blighters. I'm going to check that actually. See if that is a, what they're using for the sugar cube. Anyway, I got Toblerone twice. Hooray! Oh, I'm going to come back to that double. Um, Holly and a jumper. Mickey Mouse is mitten and a tree. We got a skate and a jumper. Pie and Christmas Day. Toblerone and a bauble, a jaunty little snowflake, and earmuffs. And hello to all my jaunty little snowflakes. How you all doing? Igloo and a present. Mickey Mouse's glove reaching for some rollos. Igloo and a jaunty little snowflake. Coins and a jumper. Pizza party and a double. I'll come back to that double as well. Earmuffs and a pizza. Half-eaten mince pie and an igloo. Sugar cube. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's the nature she's using that on that. Sugar cube earmuffs. Present and a ski lift. Skate and a bauble. And sugar cube. And a slice of pizza. So did we get a double here? No. Stack of coins. What about earlier on? Next to my Toblerone. No, it's a skate. But I did get two mountains for... Fiverr. It's not too bad, is it? Not too bad at all. Can I get a back-to-back -back win? That was card 10, by the way. You lovely statisticians out there. So this is card 11. Whiskey and a star. Pizza and a jaunty little snowflake. Star in the calendar. Sugar cube and a jaunty little snowflake. Skating on thin ice. <laughs> Um, tree and sugar cube, present and some whiskey, bauble, and a skate, mince pie and coins, igloo and some holly, pizza and some coins, tibleroon and Mickey's glove, bauble and an igloo, earmuffs and pizza, igloo and a ski lift, glove and a present. Tree in the present. Rollos and some holly. Come on, back to back win, please. Join your little snowflake and some holly. Tree in the ski lift is going to be the last time I scratch this card. I can guarantee it. Um, Rollos and a cube. Come on, end on a win for me. Earmuffs and a mince pie. Skate and a jumper. And last but not least, a whiskey and a jumper. It wasn't to be. But we did get a win on one of them, which is Naz. Right, slightly newer. Let's use. Slimer, Black Pearl. So with that fiver, that's fake pound in play, one Black Pearl, and I got myself, well, I got myself a profit session. No, I haven't. Got my money back. <laughs> Unless, of course, I win 50 quid with the Pearl. And then I got a profit session. Anyway, let's just get a Pearl. Don't count your Pearls until they hatch. Right. Let's see if we can get a match. 
two little ducks, 22. I've seen that number in a while. Number six. Ah, wrong way up. Eight. Don't recall that number. Nope. Three and four. Shut that door. <laughs> nope, was, wasn't there. 28. 28. Nope. All right, what about down here? I need to be bigger. 16 isn't very big. And it was being by 19. 23, being by 25. And can I get a good old match? VIP and some seaweed. And a vault. And a crown. It's a dud on card triple zero as well. Look at that. Went cherry picking. It's a 28, the next one. I'll just start down the bottom since we're here. Oof. <laughs> 17 being by 20. 13 being by 18. Oh, what a surprise. Right, helicopter and uh, torch, snorkel and rings, nothing doing there. What about up here? Come on, you little ball of loveliness. That's what I say every time I have meatballs. Come here, you little ball of loveliness. Right, that's a shame. Could get a match. Not with number one, we can't. It's not there. Number three. It's not there. 30. Nope. Three and eight. We got 38. Yes, <laughs> we have got to win. Uh, 38 is another one. Sometimes there's two. Nope. Can we get another number? 17. Nope, but we did get 38 for, ah, oh, yeah, get in, £10. Nice. Lovely. I'll put that with my other winner. And we'll move on to the brand new stack, S snack stack. I'm going to struggle with that. Because it's all food related, it's just a little potato. My potato, my little friend. Okay. So if you haven't seen this in action, you didn't see my other video, um, I'm not going to go over the back because I, I went through on the other video and you know how this plays. And you can see the prizes. <laughs> Let's just go for it. So we are scratching off 29, which looks like a croissant, and 33, which looks like the taco. I wanted to say wrap. Uh, 7 and 11, 7, 11, it's, it's probably the rice and the carrots, they're the two I'm really got my eye on, 3 and 5, I can't see me getting anywhere up that end, there's the rice though, 23, 28, 23, 28, I think that's the carrots, 15.25, I do like the way that the the winds start, you know, you start dreaming, don't you? Six and eight, that's all I need. I do like these sort of cards. One and 19, one and 19. Just don't break my heart. Give me a nice juicy win, please. 20 and 35, 20 and 35. Come on, six and eight. 1821, 1821, right there, 17 would give us a 30 pound win. Ooh la la, 12 and 22, 12 and 22, 12 and 22. I'm not gonna get the million. There's no way I'm getting number 24. 30, 17 or 24, that's the only possible wins, either a million or 30 quid. Or nothing at all, which is what I assumed it would be. So that was card 12, which was a dud. Now card 13. 13, my lucky number. God, show them why you're my lucky number. 2029. 20, Give me a nice big win. So pizza is the fiver now, and the apple is a tenner. 1926. 19. 26, 21, 30, 21, 
30. Getting that pizza. Two and six. Two and six. Eight and 17. Eight and 17. This is why I get excited. Look at that. Bread, 30 quid. Yes, please. 12 and 31. 12, 31, and close to that fiver. 15, 25, 34, oh, I had it then, it's over in it. 34, 36, <coughs> <coughs> I do apologize, sorry. 16, 24, 16, 24. Oh, don't break my heart. You've been teasing me with that bread all this way. Seven. Come on, at least give me the fiver. Ah! <laughs> ah, the new cards teased and did not deliver. So, wow. There you go. So, the new cards, nope. The old and the new ish, yes. So uh, we had fake pound in play, and I got two Toblerone somewhere for a fiver, and I also matched 38 for a tenner, so 15 pounds. So fake pound in play, 15 pound back, um, half my money. Um, yeah, yeah, there you go. <laughs> There's still life in the old cards, so uh, if you do see um, 12 pays of Christmas, might be worth a punt. Yeah, I know people say um, um, the new cards have the big wins on them, but I don't know. I always think the old cars are probably where, you know, your luck might reside. Anyway, look after yourself and those you love, and I'll see you again in a video. Bye.